do indeed. We've just found a wonderful herd of elephant. Some babies. There are just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are about 16, 16 or 17 elephants around us now. Um, and there were some more not too far now. I wonder if this herd isn't possibly going to go drink down at Chitra Dam. Oh, this is wonderful. Look at this. That is amazing. Here comes a big female. <laughs> How great is this? They are walking very quickly down in the direction of Chitto Chitto Dam. So I wonder if they don't go down to drink. What I'm going to do is I'll circle back and just go have a look if they do go down. That would be wonderful to see. That's a big female walking down the road there. Beautiful female. <laughs> Chitty Chatty Meg, you say this is perfect. It is indeed. It really is wonderful. Hey, what a nice surprise. Now, we, I went and had a look um, where I heard those alarm calls. Couldn't find anything, but also it was down a deep drainage line and we wouldn't have had signal down there anyway if we did, um, if we did find something. But I couldn't find the kudu that we heard alarm calling. I had a quick look around, a brief look. Uh, let's see where these elephant go. Wow, this is such a wonderful herd. A big herd and some really small ones. Young, or quite a few youngsters. I wonder where they are going, if they are going to go down to drink. It's quite cool, so I don't, I don't know if they will. Um, you know, but then again, elephants will drink when they're thirsty. It doesn't necessarily have to be hot or cold. moving very quickly that whole herd was moving very very quickly so it makes me think that they are heading towards the water often elephant get quite excited when they know they're getting close to water and they start walking a lot quicker yeah a few of them are just ahead of us quite a big herd spread out No, David, the kudu would not alarm call for the elephant. Not at all. There's no reason for the kudu to alarm call that elephant. I'm just going to stop. Hold on a second. Just over here. Oh, look at that. Um, no, David, so the kudu wouldn't alarm call at the other herbivores. Um, it's only if there's a predator around that the other animals would alarm call. Hold on a second, let me just go forward. Oh, look at that. You see those three youngsters, they all look around about the same age. Do you see that? They're all more or less, I would, I would say they're probably two years old, somewhere around there. You know what I might do, and I, I, oh, this predictive guiding, we always, we joke about it and we say it's not ideal, um, but sometimes it works, sometimes you get it right, and I think these elephants are heading down to the water, and what I may do is actually shoot ahead of them and stop and wait quietly and see if they do come down to drink. It could work, it could not. Let me do that. I'm going to go stop and hopefully we get a nice section with no signal issues. And we'll see you all shortly again. Let's head back to Taylor.